The U.S. stocks saw one of the worst days in the history on Monday, signaling the market's increasing struggle with the concern that all these emergency measures won't slow down a potential recession caused by the coronavirus pandemic. The U.S. dollar, on the other hand, remained on top of the list across the major currency pairs. Welcome to the TickMill Update. I'm Kenna Danielle, the founder of the Investiva Movement. Make sure to subscribe to the TickMill YouTube channel and support us by liking and sharing this video with your Forex trading friends. On Tuesday, besides the continued coronavirus developments, traders will be looking at the Eurozone Zoo survey, economic sentiment, and the U.S. retail sales for February. Today, I'm looking at the Aussie dollar pair, which is showing no signs of slowing down with its rapid drops. While the key support is set at 0.60, which was where the pair stopped its losses during the 2008 market crash, there is a good chance that this support won't hold this time around. A break below this level could open doors for further declines towards levels that have not been seen in almost 20 years. Now, how low do you think the Aussie will go? Head over to the comment section and let me know. Of course, trading the financial markets involves a risk of loss and you should only trade the money that you can afford to lose. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the Tickmill YouTube channel. I'll get back to you with more updates tomorrow.